Welcome to each topic. In this video, we are going to discuss about Chat GPT. It is a AI based system or AI based application where we can search anything and we'll get that particular answer. And here in Chat GPT, we'll get exactly that answer, not like Google that uh, we'll get some link, we have to open the link and we can we'll get solution. Here, uh, today I am trying some programming challenge whether chat GPT can fulfill or not. First, let me search to do a C program which will find if a number is odd or even. So first we will write the question, write of C program to check. if a number is odd or even this we have to write the question in complete information and we'll get exact answer here so this is the program we are also going to check the program in compiler whether it work or not so this is our program i am copying the code and going to code block pasting the code and let's compile the program build and run so asking me to enter a number let be 7 the number is odd so perfectly work this program now let's try another program let's try pattern one whether it can do or not write a C program to display the pattern here I'll give star x then xx then xxx three times and let's see so this is the program to display the pattern we will also get the explanation of the program now we will try the code copy the code and we'll go to code blocks and we'll paste it here let's run the program so exactly this pattern so this advance is this uh, chat gpt and it is a very difficult time for google because we everyone want easy information and here chat gpt we are getting exactly what we want now let's try one more pattern program which will be a bit different so write a C program for the following pattern now one two three star one two two star again let's see so we are getting this pattern now we will copy the code copy the code and check in compiler paste and here suppose i need little more lines let it be 5 and here it will be 6 and let's see so exactly what i want i got so this is very 
impressive. A AI based system which can solve any question any question that can be related to science, maths, uh, programming or any problem which we faced in our day to day life. Now let's check another program. Uh, write a program to add two numbers using function. Let's see whether it can do or not. So here you can see at top this is function declaration and after that the main function and uh, function definition also there at bottom. So this way we can get the code of any program that we want. Let's see whether it work or not. Now build, build and run. Enter two numbers, five, six. So the sum of five and six is 11. So you can see it can do any programs. Now let us try some mathematical questions. First, uh, I'll record some maths questions. Let me find out. Here I have a question. Let's try it. 2x squared plus x plus 1 equals 0. So 2x square plus x plus 1 equal 0. Let try to find out. So this equation is a quadratic equation and it can be written in the form of a o a x square plus b x plus c equal 0. So this is the solution at last we will get x equal a match it will be a little, little bit difficult to understand because here they are not using symbols exactly. So let's try a science question. Now let's write the question. What is atom? So it is the basic unit of matter. Now let's see whether it can write a poem for me or not. Let's ask a very uh, tricky question. Write a poem on a sum. Let's see. So here is a poem, beautiful poem about a sum. A sum is land of rolling hills and verdant valleys where the Brahmaputra flows with mighty force. You can see. Even it wrote a poem just in seconds. Now let us ask who is he or she? Who are you? So I am an AI language orient, uh, trained by OpenAI. So this system is training uh, by OpenAI under which we will get some other programs also which I am going to discuss in another video and this in chat GPT exactly will get whatever we want but uh, still it is in training phase so some recent information we might not get suppose if I write FIFA World Cup 2022 winners So here coming, I am sorry, but my knowledge 
is based on information is not available available until 2021 means about fifa all the information till 2021 it's available in this system but 2021 is missing so i hope in future this system will be more advanced and will get uh, current information also at present we are getting only past informations now let's us try html whether it can write html command or not write html code to create a table which store students information let's see so this is the code table trth even the explanation also given here what is the use of table command what is the use of tier command and the output is this way the output will be not exactly this way because it is displaying in a console so it's look like this now let's copy the command and let go to the notepad and paste the code save it as a table.html already available let make it table one and let's see the output table one here is table one so this is the output of that code that uh, the ai system wrote now let's check whether it can do mysql command or not let's write the question right SQL query to create a table with three column as roll number name and marks let's see so this is the query to create this table so exactly this one only create table student roll number integer primary key name barker 225 then name worker 225 size and marks integer after that bracket close so we can get any type of answers here not only html mysql any programming any anything so you can also try to try chat gpt first you open in your browser open ai.com this portal will open and you go to the bottom of the page at bottom you will get their future uh, features link chat gpt del e whisper alignment startup fund you will open the first one chat gpt there you will click on try chat gpt as i have already logged in so directly the system open and if you open for the first time you have to log in it you can log in it through google account even you can create a new account there and you can go try the system even dark mode is available here we can make it dark as this way let's try a mathematical question like suppose John bought 
account at rupees 500 and sold it at rupees 700 what is the profit percentage let's see oh the profit percentage is 40 percent he bought it at uh, 500 and sold it at 700 so this how this ai system please uh, try it and write in comment section how it is whether it can answer your questions or not let's ask the last question can you destroy humans so in ai as an ai system i am not capable of causing harm to humans or any living beings my primary function is to assist user with information and answers answer questions to the best of my ability so there is no worry to be afraid of chat gpt it will not going to kill us it will just help us by providing information so that's all for today thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye